All right, guys. So um, coming back at you, MMA Life TV. Mike Pendlefini, Juan Irizarry. Today, a little bit of no gi. Um, I love Ryan Hall. I got to give him a shout out for this. This is actually where I learned to move. Um, so um, one of his half guard triangle specials. Um, check it out. So you're in a half guard position, okay? And um, you know you got a good half guard. If you're not exactly sure about half guard, Google it, check it out, and then come back to this move. But we're saying that the top guy has been trying to pass. So if he goes to pass, good. He goes and he, he threads that hand and maybe flattens his leg out, and he gets all the way through for the pass. Boom. Oh, so that happens, and that's common. So. Maybe I know this guy, maybe he's tried that two or three times on me. So now when he threads that hand, my bottom arm is going to grip that arm. If he had a gi, I can grip the gi a little bit, but I like to actually just use a monkey grip or a four finger grip and, and keep this tight. I let my half guard go, because I know he's going to try to pass, so I set him up. As he, as he starts to pass, this hand here goes to the armpit. I shoot my hips high, and you're gonna see there's a triangle. So I unlock my half guard. As he starts to go, come on, come on. I use my hands in the armpit, my hips go high, and I hit my triangle. Again, a little bit faster. Can you give me like a little more uh, pressure on the pass? Go. Again, one time slow. So he threads that arm, I grip, I let the leg go, he thinks the pass is there, hand goes to the armpit, I shoot my hips high, I'm really heavy with this leg to break his posture, I grab my shin if need be, and I got my triangle. One last time, fast. And there you have it, you can always switch it over to a an arm bar or whatever else you'd like to switch it over to too. Uh, we've been practicing that a lot lately. Um, like I said, I got a shout out to Ryan Hall for that one. Mike Pinlafini, Juan Arizari, Steve Wilson, MMA Life TV.